Hi guys, behind me is the Boeing 747-8 simulator. Yesterday, in a rarity, I got on board to operate a flight to Shanghai via Xiamen. And uh, we got there before the uh, mechanics had actually started it up. They were just about to power up the airplane. So I said to them, don't do it, we'll do it. And uh, I had a trainee with me, so he had the opportunity to start up a 747 from no power at all. So um, this is the video we took yesterday before uh, the air aircraft was powered up and the processes that we went through to power up the aeroplane. Hope you enjoy it. Later. So hi guys, uh, we're on board the 747-8 uh, and we came on board and there's no power so we've got to power it up and uh, we're going to go through the procedure of powering up the aeroplane. It's dead at the moment, everything's all shut down. And uh, Wayne here is going to go through the, what we call the supplementary procedures for electrical power up. Go. All right, it's just getting this electrical power up over here. All right, the supplementary procedure for the electrical power up is uh, accomplished when the following procedure is uh, to permit safe application of electrical power. External safety confirmation is obtained. Battery switch on. So the battery, battery switch is on. on. That's it. Getting some Very life far. coming in. Off light extinguished. Standby power selector auto. Standby power selector. Yeah. Auto. Okay. Hydraulic demand pump selectors off. Hydraulic demand pump selectors all off. And they're off because if the flap lever was in any position or something like that, the flaps might immediately start moving once we power it up. So we've got to make sure those are off. We could cause damage or injure somebody outside. Next. Right. Windshield wiper selectors are off. Check. Again, we don't want them moving around, especially in a dry window. So that's why that's a check. Alternate flap selectors off. Okay. Uh, alternate flaps on this aeroplane are electrical. So if we power it up and the AC uh, power and everything's powered up the flaps could start moving or the leading edge flaps could start moving So we make sure that's also off to prevent damage or injuring somebody outside go landing gear lever down Okay, that's important. Of course Flap position indicator flap lever agreed. It's up and it's indicating up, but that's the uh, uh, Expanded indication, but that's because there's no power at the moment. Okay, go Electrical power established. Electrical power established is starting the APU. So there, to on. on, on. APU on. just means auxiliary power unit. That's it. And now we wait, and the APU should be starting up. Can you hear it? I can hear it. Okay, we've got the available. Okay, establish. Bus tie switch is auto. Bus tie switch is auto. The exter if external power is needed, external power one or external power two available, lights illuminated. External power one switch push, verify on light illuminated. Look what happens now. Push. Look at this. We're alive. <laughs> and external power two switch push when main deck cargo handling equipment is not needed. Okay, it is needed. It is needed. And then verify on light illuminated uh, if APU is needed. We've restarted the APU. Alright. So that That's completes it. the supplementary electrical power up procedure. Aeroplane's powered up. I'm going to arm the uh, emergency exit lights. I'm going to put the uh, IRS nav switches on and we're in business thank you good job later